Well, TSC got me again, the bastards. Friggin' uh, when I was having the yard sale, I was saying about uh, I was looking for a plasma cutter. Well, they friggin' had this son of a bitch on sale, and they told me I could wreck it for 30 days and bring it back if I didn't like it. So I'm gonna do a little friggin' test uh, run on this piece of equipment here, and it's only friggin' 115 volts or whatever, but uh, says it'll cut a quarter inch. So we'll see about that. I got a little, a little sample rigged up or whatever, so it uh, says it's ready right out of the box. It's got its own friggin' air compressor and different things. It says all kinds of different things onto it about different stuff. Alright, so uh, oh, we have to uh, crack this guy open, see what we got in there. It says it's ready right out of the box. So let's see what we got. Well, Instructions and some tips and different things. Not oh, crap. You can get a problem. Oh. Look at all that crap. Oh, crap, that's small it is. Yeah, it's just a little baby guy. Got a pump in there and everything. I think I'm ready. Okay, let's try this bitch out. Okay. Oh, he's on. Okay, let's try this sled out. Shit, buddy. Didn't even sort of cut through it. Take two. Yep. That's that 35% duty cycle, buddy. Thing's a piece of shit. She's going back. That sells it. She's going back. You believe that? Didn't even go through. It was didn't even didn't even. It just blew the uh, antler. Just blew the mm -hmm. son of a bitch. Went through a little bit. Almost. almost. Yeah, yeah. That's a thin one too. Good thing we didn't try the thicker one. Yeah. Well, it says that that's quarter inch right there. This one here's a little over an eighth. It says it's supposed to cut eighth like nothing, but thirty-five percent duty cycle. Seriously? Hmm. Well, back in the box. Back to TSC. I wanted to believe that Hobart wouldn't make such a piece of crap, but I've been misled. Oh crap. At least I got to wear my goggles, I guess. Yeah. Choo choo. Yeah, gonna get a real plasma cutter now. For sakes. Let's see what they got in here. Yeah. Hypertherm. That's the guy right there. All right, so there she is. What we got is a Hypertherm Powermax 45. It will cut half inch, 100% duty cycle, and it will sever up to a one inch. So, but look at the ground cable on this thing, eh? Like, uh, the, you know, you probably think, Pug, why would you buy a piece of junk? That's a no-name Hypertherm junk, but the reason why you haven't heard of them is because all they do is plasma cutters. That's it. They don't make anything else. They make the parts for uh, Ling uh, Miller pa plasma cutters as well. But like, I mean, look at this wire for the ground. Eh? It's like a. That's all you need apparently. So, but uh, one thing, you uh, to hook up this dryer uh, recommends 25 feet between the compressor and the dryer to cool the air before it gets there. So then I had to take apart my regulator because it had an oiler on it. So I just separated the regulator and the and the um, filter so and no chunks of silica or whatever from in there get blown through and into your guy because it not, doesn't take much to uh, wreck one of these sons of bitches so you want to keep the air nice and dry and you don't want it to be below 80 psi or above 
100 psi. So what what they got? This this machine is friggin awesome. So what what you got on the front here? This is for gouging all the way down. Uh, the middle is for just cutting, and the top is for like cutting like uh, expanded mesh. So it's like a pulse. So you, you know as you're going along, it it you know bites through and stuff like that or whatever. So we'll just have it on the center. So here's the uh, torch end. Just uh, you push it in, that little antler holds her down. So in the end you just got four pins, or two, three, five pins in the center antler for the air. And uh, it just plugs into there. Done deal. This machine also, you look at the regulator and you think, well it doesn't have a gauge. How the hell are you going to know what to uh, set it at? But uh, what, what, what this machine does is right here, the center uh, will glow green. And if you got too too little pressure, it's yellow. If you got too much, it's it's yellow above uh, in the in the positive there. So you you turn the knob all the way this way, and that sets it to uh, test the gas mode. Okay, so the uh, gun is on. The meter set to, to test mode, and you can see there's not enough. So you pull this up and you turn it just until you know if I give it too much, the top one. So right now that's perfect. No one got it. Push it down. Now she's set. And then and it'll shut off until you're ready to use it. So now I got the power on. And then we have uh, the uh, the temperature. If this lights up, you're too hot. If this lights up, uh, your disposables are no good and if uh, you know what I mean you got to change a tip or whatever and if this is uh, lit, lit up you got a bad ground this is the mess that I ended up with from the uh, the whole part there just totally garbage I, I managed to get almost an inch like you know about as wide as my thumb all the way through uh, but you've seen it shut off like four or five times during that process so uh, but yeah so buddy says if this thing doesn't cut half inch thick all day long uh, take it back, no questions asked, and blah blah blah. So they're trying to give me a hard time at TVC for taking back. Oh crap, that was close. For taking back the uh, the Hobart there, but it's like, dude, you know what I mean? You sold me junk. Got to cough up my money. So anyway, I'm gonna set up the uh, camera and we'll show you. I'll cut the uh, the eighth inch and the quarter inch, and uh, see how this works out. Yeah. Proceed. To So there you go, you see that cut there, you know, and that's, uh, you know, I'd obviously set it up a little better and make a straight edge and whatnot if I was going to try to cut it, you know, to build something or whatever, but you see the difference? It costs twice as much, but, like, the other one's completely useless, at least you can use this one. So now I'm going to I'm gonna cut uh, some quarter inch, this is true quarter inch. Okay, so here is quarter inch with the new plasma cutter. Look at that, just friggin' beauteous. Look at that. Oh, frig. Expensive, but worth it. Big time worth it. Yeah. So that's what I had her set at, probably, you know, 37, 38 amps. So it'll still cut, you know, that cut quarter inch pretty friggin' quick. So, and that was, you know, that wasn't even at full volume, so crank that sound bitch up a little bit and uh, I'm sure she'll uh, she'll perform friggin up to friggin code man this thing's awesome I can't even believe it I'm friggin stoked about friggin projects now yeah